My pad set is here. Mama dearest, I got something for you. All this come with the pot set? Yeah, I'm surprised too. Okay. Beyond the pot set, mm -hmm. we brought back some jerk sauce from Jamaica. Yeah. So you can cook in some jerk, jerk fish. Okay, what y'all talking about? Shazzy food! Shazzy <laughs> roll! <laughs> Look here. I don't know who this is for. So this must just be for show. <laughs> nobody here cooks but me. This is what I'll cook with. I moved my family to Atlanta because I love being around my family. There are nine people living in the house. Me, Ross, and Deuce, of course. My mom and dad. And my sister is finally here with her husband and their two boys. The house is definitely crowded. What are you going to make? I'm going to make you a fried egg. <laughs> Listen. Breakfast, my specialty. I got to put some food in the oven. Our plan to be together for about a year, and I'm hoping they'll choose to live in Atlanta permanently. I lean on them for so much. They help with Ducey, especially when work is so busy for me and Ross. I can't do life without y'all. I find that unfortunate. My sister is actually my hairstylist. My mom still manages me. Having them in Atlanta is gonna give me everything I need to take the world by storm. Mom, mom, can I get a passy, please? This stuff be running out quick. Mom, you come from Jamaica, you bring Patsy, and I have not had one, and the box done. But it's more than one box, so what are you fussing about then? You guys have eaten the whole damn box and nobody has offered me any patties. My mom took a trip to Jamaica and brought back beef patties, and everybody have their own box. My box, Shari box, mom box, and we don't want to share the boxes. Not my fault when you don't get a patty. You eating patty for breakfast. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is daddy's. Oh. So relax, okay. These are the things that I was concerned about prior to coming I don't here. want to be scrutinized. I don't want to be asked no questions. And I don't want to be told what to do. Hmm. I don't know what more they want from me. When, when you said that, what do you mean? When you there, said didn't that? Need, there didn't, didn't need to be a patty conversation. What? what? I don't have no patty problems with you guys. I just know I go to take out a patty, and all of a sudden, it's like, oh, my patty, patty, I'm patty, I'm patty. Seriously, if we just say one little thing to you, you take it like we are true big, big offense. <laughs> Next time I go to Jamaica, I won't bring back nothing at all. That's fine, Mom. That's fine. Yeah. How, how are you feeling about being here in Atlanta? It has to become my norm, you know? Yeah. Gotta get used to it. Going from being in my own home and having yeah, my own so. space, my own routine. Wasn't that all of us, though? Well, she asked me. Why are you acting like you were the no, only sir. one who had your own space? <laughs> Mom. Serious. You were the only one who had your own space. She asked me how I was feeling. I'm not speaking on behalf of you. I'm sure you feel the same way. Hello? Mercy. Now that we're all under the same roof, it does get overwhelming at times, especially when we get low on beef patties. I love being here. Being with mom is just like the highlight of my life. Just don't eat no more of the damn patties. That's no problem. Don't eat no more. <laughs> That's no problem. Get ready, get set to check your gag reflexes. One, two, shut I want a jaw dropping. I want bitches to come in there and pick their face up off the floor. Hey. Hey. King is coming over. You met her before. Yeah. Does she eat sweets? I don't know. The bitch skinny as hell right now. <laughs> she may not be eating nothing. <laughs> so oh, man, you don't have to eat them. Okay. <laughs> Don't let you, I know he a puppy. Hi. Oh, I love this doggy. Look at the chateau. It's gorgeous. Strutting in my high heels, pop at my collar. All the fellas trying to holler. Doing what I do best. Make your heart jump out your chest. Yeah. Let's go downstairs. How you know I've never been down? Well, I've been down here one time. I know. Kenya has not been in my basement since the bitch went creeping during my housewarming. Is this the basement? Oh my God! She said her house was more finished than mine. I finished it. I cannot wait to show this bitch my basement. Okay, do you remember over here, boo? Yes! <laughs> I love it! Oh my God, it's so comfy. This is like a club. Yeah. I love that you use the curved wall. Mm -hmm. So we can have a little spa day. Oh, yes. So when you do your massages or yes. anything, you're right here. I love it, Sheree. You cannot hate on this. How high are those ceilings? And we're in the basement. <laughs> Bravo. Thank, Thank you. you for coming. This yeah. is happiness, and I can see it, and it's written all over your face. I like you right now. Really? <laughs> I almost love you, bitch. <laughs> 
How was the gala, though, to you? Because I was like, okay, I'm gonna put these heels on and I'm gonna go to this gala that Marlo is throwing. I could've wore my jogger. <laughs> <laughs> The whole fake and pretentious and I got money, I got this, I got that. It's just kind of like, it's it's a turn off to me. Now you know she had a word or two to say about you. What? She started talking about how when you first got here, you lived in an apartment with white refrigerators. What's wrong with a white refrigerator? I mean, at least I could pay my rent. What else does she have to say? You had to rent somebody's uh, Range Rover, Lisa, Lisa Ray. I don't even know Lisa Ray. Girl, shut up. Not like that, like borrowing a car? I don't know. Maybe I miss her. Let me call okay. Sandy real quick. That's kind of right crazy. There. Hello? Sonia. Yes. Hey, girl, hey. Hey, I'm here with Kenya. Hi. <laughs> you look cute. Oh, thank you. What are you guys up to? Oh, my gosh. We're just dishing some tea, and I heard that Marlo was I'm talking gonna... about I was borrowing a car from someone. I think she said something about you had, like, a white refrigerator in somebody's townhouse or something. And what? I you mean, what else? Everything. She dragged poor Drew over her little bun last night. Coming from a girl who just had actual Bosley hair implants, you're talking about a girl <laughs> with, bun, with a bun. Like, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> it's a chia pet surgery. That's what it is. <laughs> Isn't it the purpose of getting the hair transplant for your edges? <laughs> Not to wear the lace front? <laughs> just go buy you a chia pet and put the seeds on your scalp, put a little water on a little grease, a little oil. Girl, get your edges back. That's all you gotta do. Get your edges back today. <laughs> I, I have love for Marlo. I, if she I, said she had love for you, too. Right, so then but why is she being sensitive? she did say you need to power wash your, ha your house. I, I do. Know. I do. I it's white. I got a good guy. We just, uh, <laughs> yes. Yeah. I, I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, bye-bye. Okay,